Today is the Herring and Beer walking tour and I'll be running it again. Now uh, they've already started because I figured since I'm running I'll start a little later but uh, yeah the, the course is right past my house so I've been seeing all these walkers coming past my house already I'm passing a lot of them right now on my way to the start so yeah let's get to the start. There are about 2,500 walkers today. Uh, a good portion of that is doing the 25K. I think somewhere around 500. And uh, the rest is doing 15K. So that's the group that started now. The 25K started two hours earlier. So I still uh, need to catch up with them. So the walk has a lot of different stops uh, with entertainment or uh, little snacks or things. Uh, they're just uh, there to make the walk a little bit more fun. Right here is the silent disco so people can dance while they're walking for a bit. this video don't forget to like and press uh, subscribe and don't forget to uh, click on the bell to <laughs> click on get the bell. updates for new videos from run arno run Woo! Woo fun thing about this walk is that i run into a lot of people that i know since it's in my hometown so uh, yeah let's see who else we can see Right here at the soccer field, there was a stop for a little snacks. It was uh, Iron Cookies. Uh, iron Cookies. It's a, a typical cookie from Vladinga. I don't think you can get it anywhere else. But uh, yeah, that doesn't agree with me too much when I'm running. <laughs> okay, so this is where we split off from the 15K crowd. They'll be going straight. I'm going this way. Uh, most of the people probably started around 8 this morning, but uh, you're still allowed to start later. Uh, I think up till 11 you can start, so I'll be running into some people, but most of the crowd is probably going to be way ahead of me right now. But uh, yeah, let's see what else we can find on this beautiful run. So we're following the white herring on the ground. Uh, up till the, the split off, it was fairly easy. There were a lot of walkers, so I just run after them. And now I have to make sure that I watch where I'm going, because a couple years ago, that didn't really uh, go too well. Uh, I signed up for the, I'm not sure if it was 20 then or 25 as well, but uh, I ended up on the wrong course, because they also had a 50K, and I ended up doing about 32, I think. I was exhausted, and considering that I run marathons, it might seem like, Okay, that's not that much, but still in my training I was only at around 20k, so I was expecting to run something like that, and 32k wiped me out. So today we're only doing 25. All 
right, I'm in a little shaded area, so I'll take a little walking break. Uh, we've been waiting for summer for a while now. Uh, it's June and we haven't really had that much uh, good weather. Of course, today uh, it's hot and sunny. Uh, probably the, the hottest day so far this year. So yeah, great day for a run. Stuff like this and make the walk a lot more fun. Uh, if you're wondering uh, why they're giving us stamps, it's uh, so you can prove that you've done the entire course. Of course, with running, you normally don't have that. But uh, yeah, all the walkers need to prove that they've uh, been to the first end of the course, which I think uh, we, we're just coming up to now. Uh, and then we're circling back around uh, Flattingen. This is the area where I normally uh, run as well when I do a circle around Flattingen, but I normally go that way and I've often wondered what's this way and I get to find out now I normally don't go this way because I'm not sure where I'm gonna end up and how much longer this is so I think I'm gonna find out now We're on the outskirts of Flattingen now, and we have a lot of green here. Now, a lot of people don't realize that we have this much nature, this much green in Flattingen, even people from Flattingen. I guess if you're not a runner or go for walks, then you don't realize how much nature and beautiful areas we have here in Flattingen. So it's fun that on a walk like this, or in my case, a run, uh, you get to see parts of Flattingen that you normally don't see. All right, that was a little uh, run compilation just from X. Run, Arno, run! Woo! first time that I ran this walk, I got a lot of uh, jokes from people that were uh, shouting at me, hey, you should be walking, not running. Uh, now I'm just getting a lot of, uh, hey, there's a guy. <laughs> Okay, we just had the lunch break area. Uh, that's where the, the 15 and 25K come back together again. So uh, I'm actually running into people uh, that I saw this morning that uh, were on the 15K course. Yeah. 
it's always great to see the cows. He agrees. Provided by the fire department. Uh, yeah, they needed water stop. I needed some water. The finish of the walking course ends up uh, where we started, uh, which is the center of town, uh, the main area where all the bars are. So yeah, basically uh, the walking tour is uh, a good excuse to end up at a terrace uh, to have some drinks. <laughs> walking tour or in my case the running tour uh, not a medal at the finish but I did get my pin uh, I enjoyed it a lot I hope you enjoyed it too until next time get out there and run <laughs>